This is the second preset in my pack and this is Lusty Glaze. So this is an adaptation of original glaze but it's a lot warmer. So if you're looking for a more kind of vintagey kind of film, kind of a little bit moodier look, this might be the preset for you and I'm going to show you how to use it. So this is one of my images, this is shot on Sony. Um, and this was shot uh, on a 50mm lens, ISO 640. So click the preset, and as you can see, it's a lot warmer, and I'm actually really digging this. So for me, I think that's kind of good there, but I'd leave it there. But as you can see, for me, I underexpose massively when I shoot originally, as you can see. So if I was to show you the kind of the original, I underexpose and that's how you can get the tones you can um, with these presets. So that's the kind of secret to getting the most out of them. Um, another image, this is shot on Sony. Again, apply the preset, Lusty Glaze, a little bit overexposed, so I might just bring that down a fraction to about there. I might boost a little bit of black, a little bit of white, and maybe bring the shadows up if I could just see a bit more of her beautiful curls and about there and I'm, I'm happy with that and I think that's really really pretty and warm so it has a really warm tone to it this is by Kirsty McKenzie this is shot on Canon so again lusty glaze and this was shot just before golden hour I believe um, so for that I might even just heat it up a little bit so bring that temperature up bring that exposure up to about there and I'm pretty happy with that. I think that's lovely, but it's a beautiful, beautiful image. Beautiful work, Kirsty. <laughs> and again, the same, same setting by Kirsty. Lusty glaze. If it's a bit overexposed, just bring it down. You might want to bring the temperature up so you get those kind of warm tones to about there. Perfect. So this is one of my wedding day images. So you can apply this to kind of outdoors as well for shooting weddings so click the preset so if you want to bring this black down you could and the whites if you want to enhance that sky you could really bring that blue back and bring that luminance down and the saturation so you've got that blue and i'd be happy with that i think that's really really lovely another image of mine from a wedding so lusty glaze to about there and I think that's really, really pretty. From the same wedding. I don't think it's straight. There we go. <laughs> uh, Lusty Glaze, click the preset to about there. And I think that's really lovely and um, just warm and fuzzy. Uh, another image by Kirsty McKenzie, shot on Canon. So click that. So if that looks too washed out, you can just bring the exposure down to about there. Perfect. You can even bring the temperature up if you want to because it's quite clearly a sunny day. So this was shot indoors. So you can also apply it for other kind of looks. So this would be a really nice look for a kind of a vintage look. So I click that and you've got a really nice vintage feel, kind of Wes Anderson vibes um, here. So about there. Perfect. And I think that's really, really cool actually. It really just works with those sort of colours. Outdoors, the lovely Jordan, mm, Oscar. Uh, so click Lusty and bring that down a fraction to about there. And again, you've got a lovely, warm, vivid, kind of vintage feel look to that. And I love that. Uh, another wedding. So Lusty Glaze to about there. Pretty happy with that. Doesn't need changing. An engagement shoot, this is shot on Sony. Click Lusty Glaze, you might want to make it even warmer because it is a sunny day. Bring those blacks down. Yep, happy with that, done. This was shot in Jamaica. Check me out, wearing a swimming costume. But I chose this image because it was quite washed out. So as you can see, that's the original. Um, so this is a really kind of nice one to get that kind of warm tropical vibe. Bring that exposure down that temperature up to about there nice oh hey it's yours truly lusty glaze again and that just enhances and just 
really makes my skin look pretty good actually. So that's a nice um, a nice preset for um, skin tones. And what you could do is you could Photoshop all the seaweed out. Uh, again, wow, that's really underexposed. <laughs> uh, so click Lefty Glaze, bring that exposure up. Hello, bit warmer to about there. Don't think that's even straight. No, it's not. Hello, central. There we go. To about there. Vibrancy might even bring it even more. To about there. That's nice, yep, yeah, feeling that. Again, really underexposed, but the benefit of underexposing, remember, is you can save it in post production. So, again, click Lusty Glaze, and I think this works so well for this type of setting because look at those rich, warm tones. Bring those blacks down if you really want to make it pop, and that white, and those shadows, that exposure. Bam! That is pretty sexy and vibing on that beautiful this was taken in Morocco by the way um, and this is England <laughs> so lusty glaze click bring that up bring that temperature up if you want it to be kind of a bit more contrasty bring that down a little vibrant yep happy with that that's done again click lusty glaze so again, bring that exposure up to about wherever you want to. It depends what your vibe is. If you like quite dark, if you like it really exposed, if you're going for more fine art look. Just depends. For me, I would probably do about there. Make it a bit more vibrant. Bring that black down. If I really want to go into that green and play with it, I can go in and just have a play. If I'm not really vibing on the green. If it's like green, green, or like saturated whatever your vibe is for me i'm about here-ish with my greens um the lovely katie rogers one of her shots again click and i think that works really really well bring that exposure down a fraction a bit warmer bring that black down boom that's really pretty i like that and finally another engagement shot so click lusty glaze click the preset so again this is a good example of when it kind of has gone a wishy-washy and just desaturated so bring that temperature up because it looks really blue so make it warmer so bring that vibrance up black down white up shadows up maybe even warmer yeah to about there oh there done so there you have it that is lusty glaze so a really nice kind of warmer adaptation of original glaze if you like things a little bit moodier a little bit warmer but as you can see it's a really versatile preset um across various lighting scenarios and various camera makes and models uh, and i'd love to see your edits so please tag hashtag rc presets to be featured on instagram